here Boots and I are ready for our June horse agility at liberty and number one is to ask the horse to wait to walk past the curtain without going through it and then to ask the horse to trot through the curtain so I'm asking Boots to walk on and then trot on and she did that really well I was pleased with that and then I had got a little bit distracted there to find the entrance to our S-Bend and the task was to walk through the S-Bend together and she was doing a very nice job bringing her hind end around those tight corners and we had to do a a very sharp right hand turn to bring us to number three which was a left hand turn on the tarp and we negotiated that all right and then it was straight across to our mat to number four we had to halt with the back feet on the mat and stand for ten seconds and although you can't see very clearly she did have only her back feet on the mat she's giving a little bit of an extra smile during the ten seconds and we had to make another sharp right hand turn to head back to the other side and she thought it was something to do with the tarp but it wasn't so I said no no not the tarp come over here and halt and get ready for number five which is to take this noisy rattly crunchy plastic bag and to sniff it which she did and number six was to put that bag on her neck and I think we lost a mark there and begin a weave which is an L-shaped weave still rubbing the bag as we go along <coughs> rubbing the bag on her neck this looks a little bit deceptively easy but it was a little bit tricky and finally number eight we have to put her nose on an object and keep it there for five seconds again something we practice quite a bit because it looks deceptively easy but the horse can take a lot of different meanings from it and another sharp right hand turn to walk all four feet over the pole halt and then back all four feet over the pole ideally without touching the pole at all and you can see how careful she is there and she had a minus one there for stepping on the pole that was pretty good and number 10 is to walk over the pole and this one tests to see if the horse isn't being presumptuous and thinks oh we got to back over it again so we had to halt for five seconds before we walked on and that's it that's our 10 obstacles